Welcome to 664 Sea Grape on Marco Island. We're going to go inside and check out this beautiful home. Just want to give you a little tour of where we're at. We are on the south end of the island. And just panning around to give you an idea of the location. I'll point out just over the house right there. That is the Vacation Club Marco Island Marriott. So if that gives you an idea of how close we are to the beach, that building that's peeking up right over there, that's where the beach is. So we are literally a hop, skip, jump, roll, whatever it takes you to get over there, we are right there. The roof will point out the shingle roof was put on or installed in 2016, according to the owner. We have a full seller's disclosure. So let's go inside, take a look, and see what it has to offer. Okay, as we enter into the home, you're gonna have this beautiful living area. It is a step down right there. Living area in here is just over 2,200 living square feet. As we pan to the left, we have a hallway that takes us down and back into the family room and kitchen. As I pan to the right, you're going to have the primary bedroom there. Why don't we start over here? Now this home is currently being used as a vacation rental or has been in the past been used as a vacation rental. You here on Marco Island do have the ability uh, to rent out nightly or weekly, monthly, however you feel. And currently the owner tells us during season, January through April, he was receiving about $350 to $400 a night. So here's the backyard. Yeah, we're going to go see. Don't worry. Don't worry. Hang tight. We're going to get out there in a minute. But there again is that building I was pointing out to you out front. That is where the beach is. Nice thing to note here is that everything that you see comes with the property, the bedding, the furniture, everything. So now we have a closet here and it walks through. We'll just pop on through it so you can see. Nice sized closet. Now we're in the primary bathroom. So we have a jacuzzi tub, shower. Then we have one vanity there and another vanity over there with the private watering closet right there. And then look, we pop right back out to that primary bedroom. On Marco Island in this particular area, there is no homeowner association fees. So that's always a nice attribute I like to point out. Now, some might wonder, what are the taxes like? Well, taxes can vary on items like whether or not you homestead the property. So right now, the, pro the taxes for this particular property are about 70, 7,700 a year, so 7,000. Now here we have the laundry room, tub sink. We have the garage, two car. Let's just take a peek, painted floor. Plenty of room. The kitchen, nicely sized and redone. Okay, so the fridge I believe is 2022, 2023. Again, we have a full seller's disclosure going over all the items that have been taken care of with this property. Now, this is the step down into that living space where we first came in. So you have a dining space here you have the living space there. There's that primary bedroom again. That's the front door. And we come back in. Here is the family room, kitchen, and then I'm just gonna twirl, twirl, twirl here for you. And we have another eat-in space here, okay? Then you also have the breakfast bar. So plenty of space for the family here. This would be a great annual home for someone, seasonal, lots of options. The AC unit, according to the owner, was replaced in 2014 with a new temp sensor in 2021. Now we're gonna head over here. This is gonna be where the rest of the bedrooms are, two more bedrooms and a bathroom. This is a split plan property. There's a new water heater in the property as of 2022. So this is guest bedroom number one. 
Note that we have nice tile on the floor, easy to maintain. There's your closet. Then we have the guest bathroom. We'll get there in a second. Let's take a look at the other guest bedroom. Nicely sized rooms. Sometimes when the homes have built, like this one's built in 1978, some of those homes are smaller. The bedrooms can feel smaller. These are nicely sized. So as we turn and look, you have the closet over there. Now we're gonna come back out here, take a look at the pool bath. So that's where the door goes out to the pool. You have a shower there, two sinks, and then over here is the shower with the access to outside. Okay. What's behind door number one? Let's take a peek. Oh, it's locked. I can't show you. Uh-oh, must be an owner's closet. All right. Let's take a look at this kitchen a little clo more closely. All right. I love this window with the views out there. And in fact, this, this table and chairs is newer, the owner says, and it still has a warranty on them. Nice countertop space. Here's your living room area, which this furniture is newer as well. Then as we pan, look at the size of this TV. The owner says it's an amazing, amazing TV set and you have to see it to believe it. Another note that I'd like to make of the property is that there is a new electrical panel. There was an exterior paint job done to the home in September of 2023. And when we go outside to take a look at that pool next, I want you to know that that pool pump, according to the owner, was replaced in 2023. So let's go take a look outside. And here is the, how do they say that? Piece de la restance of the home. I don't know, my French is a little, a little uh, shady there. I'm not quite sure if I'm saying that right, but we are in the backyard of this beautiful property. And I'm just going to make some points out here. So new fencing around the side. What's great about this property is there is no landscaping really that you need to take care of. So if you can come here, you don't have to worry about cutting the yard or spending time weeding too much. You've got plenty of room for entertainment. Huge lanai space here. You have a gate that takes you right into the back here. So you can literally just hop, skip over to the beach. So again, this building right here is the Marco Vacation Club and the entrance to the beach, the walkway is right next to it. So that is how close we are to everything. And you do have three entry points, one, two, three. So that's your main bedroom, the living room, the family room, and then over here, I just wanna point out, that's where the pool bath comes out. So that's always a nice uh, add-on as well as the outdoor shower that's right there as well. The roof was done, I believe in 2016. Again, we do have a full seller's disclosure to go over all of the items here at the property. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us. Let us know that you liked this video by hitting the like button and subscribe.